Kweku Gaba operated a DSTV viewing center here at Sokoban and had his place raised down by fire. He narrates to City News how the fire incident occurred. Mpacho Enrua, five to six more, no, no. Ye yi bo wa ha. Ana sa ta mo ne bo no so be sha sha yi ta mo ne yi be bo bo. Ana ye be bi e yi no center no. Che ana ma fo wo inside no. Che ho na se me light no so. E ja to mo. Che light ne ja to mo no so me ka se bi a light off na dia dia no no me. Na me ko do me me shishi no. Che me do me shishi ne nche na obi so jina bo nche no so. Ne dai ki to e bi wo me me dia ne nche. Che na oni pa ne se ah e dan we ne ja to mo. Chia ba sana sana ama ni dia na bato me 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 la ya nomanchi. Chia epi ba ya nane ne hano ase jana ashi hop de chia hana jana free hana na odiba me 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 e dia nemo. The organizer for Sokoban Wood Village Workers Association is Kwesi Amedunu. His two structures got destroyed. He wants Nadmo and other government agencies to come to the aid. Oh, not for me. So I want to beg the government to come to help the people here about me. Yes, yes. So uh, today the assembly member came here this morning, and the Nadmo people come here in this morning. According to officers from the Ghana National Fire Service, although it took them only seven minutes to get to the fire scene after receiving the distress call. Some persons attacked them for being late, and police officers had to be called to maintain calm. In an interview with City News, the Ashanti Regional Public Relations Officer of the Ghana National Fire Service, DO3, Peter Ose Ade, urged the public to refrain from attacking them. We want to advise the general public that we are here to serve them. So when they, it is only when they call us when there's a fire incident and they call us, then we can respond. So when they call us in time, we'll be able to respond in time. So we want to advise that when there are fire incidents, they should call us in time so that we can respond on time. Considering what happened yesterday, we realized that our response was very swift because it took us about seven, seven minutes to get there. But the people had the perception that we got there late and uh, we reacted the way they did. So we want to advise them to uh, exercise patience, allow us to be able to do our work when they call us for such incidents. As a number of fire outbreaks have been recorded within the Sokoban Wood Village enclave over the years, the leadership of the Sokoban Wood Village Workers Association wants authorities to set up a fire station in the area. Samoya Luga is the chairman of the association. Uh, it's quite laudable. If uh my colleagues are calling for a fire station to be set up within the enclave. It's a welcome news, but I don't know whether it is politically this thing, I don't know. I don't know whether it is financial situation, I don't know. Even it's of late that even busts where petrol is being discharged. It's only recently that they've given a fire tender at the station there. So I know Wood Village, within the program, there is a place for a fire tender or fire station for the whole enclave. So it's a lot of idea which are uh, being proposed by my colleagues. The fire officers have been reacting to the association's proposal. Uh, there is a fire coast actually at Bost, which is very close to the incident. There's also a fire station at the regional headquarters, which is also close to the place. So that area is actually covered. It has a fire cover. The road network within this area has been a major worry for the people here. And whenever there are emergencies such as uh, fire outbreaks, it becomes difficult for officials to get here. From Sokoban Wood Village, I am Edward Upon Marfo for City News.